I to 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 I to 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 to. I'll never forget around when I was three or four in Chattanooga, Tennessee, where I grew up pretty much off and on with Pikeville, Tennessee. I lived in a duplex with my mom, and my brother was there half the time, if not most of the time. And uh, it was a nice area. I still love it there. It's a beautiful place. But um, my mom, you know, she was a single mother. And uh, so we lived in this little duplex. It was like two or three bedrooms. I believe a two-bedroom duplex. That's some of my first memories. And this kind of looks like it, but it was bigger, of course, and a little bit um, nicer, I think. I used to live, I've lived um, by it as well, and I always looked at this house. But So I was walking through the hall, and the hall um, had my mom's room. My room was at the other end. And uh, it was at night. It was about 9 or 10 at night, probably. And uh, so I walked by my mom's door to go to the living room. And uh, so I peered in. And this was the one time in my life, and the only time in my life outside of dreams, that I have ever frozen in fear. So this is a true story. So when I looked in my mom's room, I froze in fear because what I saw was a bunch of red eyes, literally just red eyes, reddish and white, just glowing fucking eyes all in the room. And uh, there were so many beings. The room was packed full of humongous, giant fucking monstrous demonic horror movie from hell horned like minotaur looking monsters and uh, they had horns I remember mostly the eyes and the horns and I froze there for I don't know how long but a few seconds probably probably about 10 seconds and uh, they made this really fast there's so many of them talking and speaking guttural like what you would think a big huge monster that literally was almost as tall as a ceiling it was insanity so they were speaking really fast and you know a bunch of guttural monster voices and uh really freaked me the fuck out so my brother walked by in the living room and saw me frozen in fear and asked me what was wrong and so it snapped me out of that strong fear I've never experienced before in my life and I walked with him towards him away from that crazy fucking room my mom's room and told him what I saw and I told him there were monsters in mom's room and he went back with me and flipped on the lights and it was like nothing was there and he told me it must have been my imagination and uh, I know it was not my imagination because I remember it to this day. So this is one of my um, other few paranormal experiences, I guess I should call them, that I've had. And I hope you enjoy this. I've had a few other paranormal weird-ass experiences besides the Army Training Area UFO that I watched for like 30 minutes. And uh, I remember this shit still to this day. I'll never forget it. And uh, I believe it was some kind of demonic activity shit that was going on, probably because my mom uh, was kind of wild during those days. So uh, let me know what you think. This is Sly Tiger. Thanks for listening. Take care.